Looks like you've hit a snag. So welcome back to... In the last episode, we cleared out the jungle with Diddy and Donkey and poor Donkey Kong got hit. Well, no, no Diddy got hit, but uh, I guess Donkey did too. I, I don't know. The Donkey and the Diddy. And in this episode, we're taking on the plane with Mario and Pit. I'm going to be starting off with Pit, seeing as we finished off with Mario last time, because Mario, he got enough screen time. I think he's... I think he's established the fact that he has been on screen far longer than most majority of uh, other Nintendo characters. Right here we have a new enemy. This is a Boboros. Apparently what they like to do is they like to blow you. Yeah, that's not suggestive at all. No. But it does get irritating later on because they actually put them in convenient places where they would pretty much genuinely get in the way and be rather annoying because uh, they put them like right in front of the other enemies and stuff. It's really annoying. When they're not blowing... They dance around like little pansies. Yeah, I don't get it either. What were you thinking, Gankerator? What were you thinking? I don't know what what's going on in uh, his mind when he makes some of the stuff, but hey, you know, I... How did I die from that? Really? Really? That's not even worth, like, mentioning that I died to that. You know, I didn't die from that. I didn't... You just... That's what you thought you saw, okay? That's just what you thought you saw. Okay, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna blow you. Away. What are you away? There you go, that way I can get ahead of you. Yeah, take that. Strategy of the Bahuzi! Okay. That thing does 42 damage per hit. What the heck are you made out of? You stupid fish with tentacles. That's kinda creepy, actually. A uh, little fun fact for you guys. The actual smash symbol for the uh, games is actually supposed to be a window with the morning sun coming out of it, so yes. It's actually kind of odd. I never would have guessed that was what it was. Oh my god! This is terrible! I'm actually gonna put this up? What? Yeah, I'm putting this up. Screw that. And uh, right here we have a new enemy. These are called Ticktons. Apparently... <laughs> this is stupid! You know, I'm just ignoring all these enemies. Screw that. When you kill a Ticktin, a little chick comes out of it because apparently it was being held captive inside of its stomach or something. I don't know. And what is wrong with this place? I'm just avoiding all the enemies. Screw that. You know what? You enemies can just go die in a pit of fire, kind of like I'm doing right now. No, I want to kill you and caress your deliciousness that is inside your pants. I'm not talking about that kind of deliciousness, no. Screw you, Baboris. God. Baboris, Rarialis, or whatever. Come on, die. Die, die, die. Go with the title, man. Go with the flow. Oh, gee, I wonder which way I was supposed. Really? Really? That was an asshole move. I'm sorry. If I've ever done seeing one, that was a jerkish move. No more. I'm not gonna take it anymore, okay? I'm not gonna take it anymore. I'm down to 100 HP. Is it Stop it! Good lord, man! What is wrong with you people? I'm not that bad of a person. You, you don't even know me. What the frick? Oh, no, you don't. I'm in a close quarter, so you can't do that to me. Nope. Nope. Can't do it. Well, it looks like I could have gotten this if I wasn't Mario and I was Pit. But evidently, I'm the short and stacky little plumber. So, yeah, it's not going to work out. Uh, the fish is going to come down, right? Oh, good. Stay up there, you little prick. I don't need you. Oh, come on. More of this? Really? Really? Distract him! Let's go through the door. I don't need to pay attention to you! You just want the attention! I'm gonna die here, aren't I? I'm gonna die! I'm gonna die! I'm gonna die! I'm gonna die! We look at me! I'm going to die soon! <laughs> oh, this is... this is terrible. This is terrible right here. Why, why is this happening? What have I done to you, mother? Why? I've always been the good little boy. What am I talking about? My commentary is just nonchalant. I don't really know what's going on anymore. Good strategy is to actually knock the primid or primid off the edge of the stage instead of fighting them sometimes. It actually works out a lot better. We have the introduction of a new primid right here. This is a fire primid. Apparently they have the same icon as a regular primid. Not sure what's up with that. But they can spit fire. Yeah, they're fire-based enemies. It's like the role of Pokemon! They actually have elemental-based attacks. What the hell? 
And I died! Two for the price of one. Gonna cut back to that point, though. Alright, so I'm back here. We're gonna finally take these guys out, hopefully. Let me throw... You know what? I might just throw them off the stage. It'd be easier. We don't have to worry about this fool. Or they could all just stand in the same place and make it a lot easier for me. You... Nope. You're all going to get arrowed in the knee. Yeah, yeah, I made a reference. What of it? Screw you. <laughs> I love... What? What happened? I am confused. I didn't even do anything. I hate you. Go away. Go away! You don't have anything I want. You don't have anything I want. Even though I got the star run, I kind of wanted that. Oh, no you don't. You will go over there. And I will defeat you, and it will be a marvelous victory. You see what I mean by bad enemy placement right here? They got the Paporos right there, right by the edge where all the enemies are. So that's going to be taking you off quite a bit. If you can't uh, hit certain enemies, and they can hit you, you know? That always tick me off. There you go, Baborosh. Boop. Boop. Boop, boop. Wow, you guys just stay on the ground for a while, don't you? Maximum tomato? Wow, that's actually pretty helpful. I'm not going to lie. That's, that's great. That's really fantastic. Thank you very much. And the last of the boss gauntlet. Well, not boss gauntlet, but you know what I'm saying. No, stop it. You piece of poop. You poopy pants. You poop pants! I can't believe! Yeah, whatever. Okay, so we're gonna take out the rest of these guys. Not much to go over right now. I'm just saying random bullcrap. Hopefully, you guys will find it entertaining with my grunts and groans and mayhem going on in this place. I can't believe I died to all those Tictons, though. I don't even know why they're called Tictons. I mean, it's not like they have a clock based on them or something. Food! Run for the door! Oh, wait, sticker. Right for the door! Right for the door! Oh wait, there's no door. Pooh. Look, Pit, I know you, you, like, have limited flight and all, but that is no excuse to use Mario as a footstool. Seriously. What a joke, man. What a joke. You should be able to fly, you little prick. Uh, anyway, we almost caught the Ancient Minister. He is a bad minister because he has destroyed my faith in all that I believe in. So, in the next episode of... Dynamite. Smash Brothers X. We're going to be taking on the lake and seeing what's going on over there. Looks pretty close to the jungle. This jungle out there, baby. So, I will see you in the next episode. Later.